I'm Howard Hale. Thanks for joining us for the Cattleman's Corner. I'll be back with today's guest right after this. Here's a chance to buy at auction 100 head of 30-month-old Angus bulls that don't need to be pampered. That's at Jorgensen Land and Cattle Company's October 2nd auction. These bulls have 60 years of stacked performance genetics. For more information, go to jorgensenfarms.com or go to cattlemanscorner.com and type in Jorgensen. And there's a really good horse sale coming up on October the 3rd. That's the Heartland Breeders Horse Sale. You can find it by going to horsemanscorner.com. That's horsemanscorner.com. With us on the program today, Mark Peeper, Peeper Red Angus at Hayes Springs, Nebraska. First, how's the weather been treating you guys up there? How are the pasture and range conditions? Been really dry this summer, Howard. Uh, We're probably the driest we've been for years. Sure, use some moisture. Are you having to move any cows off the grass earlier than you normally would then? Oh, yes, definitely. Um, weaning calves early, and the cows are actually going to winter pasture already. Having to supplement them then? Um, not at this point we aren't, but they won't be long. What do you use for uh, winter feed for your cow herd? Typically, we graze the cows till we start calving in February just on grass and cake. This year it's going to be a little different. We're going to have to start feeding hay early for sure. And talking about hay, how are the hay supplies? Sure, down from a year ago. Of course, a year ago was great. But, yeah, pretty tight in this area. Uh, East of here, they've got a lot of hay, it looks like. Mark Peeper, Peeper Red Angus at Hay Springs, Nebraska. Thanks for joining us for today's Cattleman's Corner. Always great to have you along. May God bless, and you come back and join us again, won't you? I'm Howard Hale.